there was a Mega Drive game that was only released in Australia. And it was ported later to the Super Nintendo, and then it came to Europe. Wow, you Europe. must have dug deep to find this thing. They celebrate Christmas in Australia? I thought it was all just about the kangaroos. Wait, did they have an advent calendar? That's pretty awesome. Yeah, so, uh, this is cute. Like, I can do this. It's animated really well, actually. Yeah. Oh. Already, this is like 100% improvement from the Home Alone games. Oh. This definitely has to be a later in the Sega's life. Why? Because the animation is good. Like, uh, the graphics are, are good. They're pretty 3D and dynamic. Look, even the fire is burning pretty well. And the frame rate's high. This is pretty clutch. Whoa. He turned into a present. So, he's kind of like a violent Santa Claus. No, no, maybe not. He's not violent yet. Wait until you get to the fifth level and you pick up the machine gun. Where the hell did he come from? It doesn't matter as long as you determine the presents. And it's just like Sonic, instead of our big ring at the end, it's a star. <laughs> Are penguins at the North Pole or the South Pole? They're in the South Pole, which is why they're not supposed to be there. You have to... That's what I'm saying. They're, they're an invasive species. This is a cute uh, platformer. I mean, neither great nor bad uh, for its time period. I mean, uh, pretty good, actually. Is it... Oh, what? I was supposed to... Okay. I love the music here. It's kind of like the castles in uh, Super Mario. Reindeer! Kind of like Yoshi in, uh, in Mario Bros. Like, you start riding him. He's rotoscoped. Did they only sell this game certain times of the year? Oh, I told you, like, I, 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 I really don't know anything about this. Maybe in Australia, it's Christmas all the time. Oh, oh. Oh, and now you're a... A demon? Demon Santa. Maybe it's a Krampus reference. Oh, yeah, other than Santa's Rescue, this is probably the closest ah! true Christmas game we've played. Cut try it. All right. This might be the only official Christmas Ooh, game cool. on both consoles. It's funny, I've never seen a review for this game. I, or I don't remember one in the game. It probably got, like... If Game Pro Magazine did a review of this for the Super Nintendo, it would have been, like... A half page thing. You were thinking about how hard it must have been to make these games back then. But now you could tell that they got like a gist of it. You're just annihilating all the penguins. There ain't no happy feet on freaking Santa's Island. He definitely needs like a rocket launcher or machine gun or maybe some grenades. Oh look, now I'm going to the countries. All the presents that I had, I now have to dump off somewhere. I actually had to. In the chimneys? Yeah. The ones with the steam in it? Yeah. It's almost like I had to put out the fires, got it. This is such a obvious dynamic. I, I didn't know why I didn't uh, see this coming. All right, wow, actually there's a password going on. It's funny, I just said how overly simple this game is and now it just got complicated. I'm starting to see how this is kind of repetitive. It is, but I feel like many, many games back in the day were like oh, that. Oh, oh the water's mistake. going up. I love how every time we start saying that it's repetitive and boring, it starts adding a new factor <laughs> yeah. into it. So I guess the water has to be over your head. It's almost like you're actually drowning. What, what the hell, hell is that? The wood factory, uh... You're standing on a heart. If you want to get a, a game for your kids and you don't want something that's super violent, this is definitely better than Art Alive. Oh, that's funny, the eyes even follow me like, wow, that guy should jump on over everything. No! What do you think of it? Pretty clever, pretty fun. It makes the kids just shut up during Christmas when the grown-ups are talking or making dinner. This is definitely a game that, like, when, like, when you're having, like, a fam- like, an extended family Christmas, and you want to shut the kids up and you give them like this one game. I literally just said that. Right? I know, that's that's what, and I'm adding on to it. But yeah, you actually found a, an, an actual Christmassy themed it, game that was it's more the only one. Thanks for uh, following us uh, during this uh, Christmas journey. Yeah. Or, or a holiday journey, whatever. 